Hello, my name is Lauren Robinson and I'm a sophomore criminology major, Afro-American studies and Spanish dual minor from Atlanta, Georgia. It is my firm belief that we all have an important role and responsibility to play in ensuring that our community and our country as a whole become more equitable for all. Which is why I have a pretty extensive history of getting into what the late and great John Lewis would call good trouble. My senior year of high school, I co-founded an organization called the Ethnic Student Alliance. The purpose of the organization was to provide the ethnic and racial minorities in our school with a safe space to express their concerns about things going on in our school communities and to provide a pathway to a, an effective and substantive conversation with school administration. For a while, the conversation seemed to be making progress, but then at one point, it just seemed like everything stalled. And everyone, myself included, started to become very frustrated because there were just repeated incidents of racism and cultural insensitivity that kept occurring from both students and faculty at the school. So myself and the three other co-founders of the organization decided that we were going to stage a racial equity walkout. School administration was aware, but I'm not entirely sure that they understood the full scope of what was going to be happening. We sent out communication to our fellow students and told everyone to wear all black, bring bullhorns if they had them, and right after lunch during sixth period, we all walked out of class. We started chanting and yelling and marching around the perimeter of the school. And you could tell that some of the school administrators and teachers were kind of taken aback by how many people actually participated. But I think that that ended up being a good thing in the end. Because the following week, our principal and our school director actually scheduled a meeting with myself and the three other co-founders to discuss what could be done to help address these issues of racism within our school. And we actually ended up coming up with the idea of holding a cultural sensitivity day where we spent an entire half of the school day just educating our fellow classmates on what it means to be culturally sensitive and how to root out racism and your own personal biases, not only for yourself, but for your family and other members of our school community as well. It ended up being a very effective demonstration and the changes that we helped implement are still in place at the school today. So that's the story of how I got into some mischief for change and how it actually ended up working in the end. Thank you all so much for your time and consideration.